Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you what I've been working on. I want to show you some friend mail that I received. And um, yeah, so first I want to show you my winter tree. This is what it's looking like so far. Um, I did put those icicles on it here. I got some little snowflakes. I think I'm going to take the little balls off of it, the little jingle bells off of the tree because I want just like the snowflakes on there. But I got like four of the snowflakes. I hope this is coming across good. And then I'm going to get like that white snow thing with the sparkles on it to put around the bottom of the base. But this will stay out all winter. And um, this is what it's looking like so far with the icicles and the little snowflakes. And like I said, I think I'm going to take the little jingle bells off the bottom of that. But I wanted to show you that's how you buy them, you know. But I want just the snowflakes going down, not, not that. So anyway, yeah, and you can take that off. That, that can break right off. And I can use those for something else. But anyway, I want to show you the, the winter tree. So we got that going. All right, let me put that down here. All right. Now I've been working on this. I've been crocheting another scarf. But this scarf here, I'm going to be putting a hood on it and pockets. And this is what this is. This is in the moss stitch. And as you can see, I still got a little bit more here. Um, but this, this is the color of it. And again, I'm going to be putting pockets, but different kind of pocket. I want to make it, I'm going to make the pocket separate. And it's going to have a hood. So it'll have its own separate hood. You know, just picture it, right? <laughs> anyway guys yeah I wanted to show you that so I am working on that okay I want to show you some friend mail first and then um I'm going to show you my pillow and my pen collection oh and I want to show you something else so I received this friend mail from Barbara and she's from California and she sent me a nice message on the inside. Thank you so much, Barbara. I was so surprised to see this. And um, she, she saw that I do diamond painting, right? And uh, oh, she said she hopes that she likes the one that she picked for me. So she picked me out a diamond painting, guys. So, oh, I was so surprised. And let's see. This is from Barbara, California. Barbara, thank you so, so much. Oh, these keep me sane these days. These uh, diamond paintings. You know, something to do. Okay, so it's a DIY 5D fashion diamond painting. Looks like flowers, guys. I can't make it out. Uh, oh, all right. It's a bird. Okay, here's a flower, and then you can see the birds. Oh, you can see it much better there than looking at it up close. But you got the birds and the flowers. Oh, that's so pretty. This is like what I'm doing, like the wildlife stuff and um, landscape, stuff like that. That's what interests me in the diamond painting, but look at that. And I want to show you guys, in the diamond painting, they call these drills. You get all the drills in diamond painting. Let me show you. Oh, I love it, Barbara. I love it. Thank you so, so much for thinking of me. This is beautiful. And these are called drills. And this is what makes the pictures. And you get all different color drills, all different colors, as you can see. And that's what makes the picture so beautiful right there then you get the um the tray you get a little thing of wax so the drills go in the tray you put wax on the tip of this to pick up the drills and this 
I might do a, a video doing it too. I also wanted to do um, arm knitting. But anyway, this comes back and this, whoops, I'm trying to show you. This is sticky and this is where the drill stick to it. So that is so, so pretty. Thank you so, so much. Oh, I love it. Yes, I do love it. Thank you. So this is all going to go back in here till I'm ready to work on it. I'm still working on my parrots. <laughs> I started picking that up again. Um, yeah, when I get bored with one thing, I go and I do another, but I'll finish it. I finish everything because once I get going, then I don't stop. So anyway, like I said, this was from Barbara from California. Thank you so much, Barbara. I love it. Thank you so, so much. Okay, now I'm going to show you my pillow that I made. Now, this uh, pillow is the placemats that you get at the Dollar Tree. And I bought two, one for the front of the pillow and one for the back. I used a regular uh, pillow that you use on your bed to stuff it. And guys, I hardly used any stuffing out of that pillow at all. There's still so much in there. So if you're looking for stuffing and you don't want to get the little bags, buy the cheapest pillow you can find, you know, at Walmart or wherever. And you cut it open and use that filling for your stuffing. But anyway, uh, I used this. I got this from the Dollar Tree. Uh, I can actually crochet with this, guys. I can make dishcloths or something out of these, too. And I bought different colors, but I used the blue for this pillow. And I whip-stitched it around. I know a lot of people hot glue it or whatever. No, I wanted to, like, whip-stitch it all the way around. So here's what it is. Here's what it looks like. Are you ready? There's the pillow that I made. And there's the whip stitching all around, top and bottom. There's the other side, all the whip stitching around. It's so easy, guys, the whip stitch. Just get a, a yarn needle or, you know, a thick enough needle. And then just go dun, 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 all the way around. One way. Bump, bump, bump. In here, back there. Around, around, around. Until you make these loops at the top. Like that super easy but this is the pillow it's nice and soft and if you get it and you got that musty smell I had apple cider um apple cider spray by Body Ecology. I sprayed it with that and it got that smell out of there because some of them have a musty smell to it but if you spray it yeah I can still smell my body spray on here um it gets rid of that musty smell but look at the pillow, guys. There it is. Oh, my gosh. And that stays out all winter long with my winter tree. So there you go. Didn't that come out good? I think it came out good. Yeah, I'm happy with it. And it's super soft, you know. And you can feel like the tapestry. So I like that. I like that a lot. I might be making more of these if I see different uh, prints and stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do with that. You ready for my pen collection? <laughs> okay. Ta-da. Oh, my gosh, guys. You're not even seeing half of it in there. Not even half of it. Let me show you some of what's in here. This bucket I got at the Dollar Tree around Valentine's Day. It has hots all around it. And I thought, what could be more perfect for my pen collection, right? And I just keep shoving them in there, shoving them in there, shoving them in there. And like I said, I'm not attached to any of them except the ones that were given to me through friend mail. So again, these are the ones, these are like the pom-pom ones. I'll bring out these first and then I'll show you some of the more unique ones. So these are all the pom-pom. Let me get all the pom-pom ones out. This came from um, Diane. She got me that, and, and I have another one, too. Diane from Chicago, and then that. These are all the pom-pom ones. Kitty cat with the glasses. Look at this one. 
<laughs> that came from the Dollar Tree. A lot of these came from the Dollar Tree, but a lot of them I got at uh, Family Dollar. And then, like I said, Friend Mayo. So here's some more pom-pom ones. Got a lot of pom-poms. And they take up a lot of room. This one, look at this. With the googly eyes. See, I keep all the tags on them too, guys. I don't take the tags off. <laughs> I know. I know. Mini Pearl. If any, yeah, I'm showing my age now. Mini Pearl. Okay. Oh, look at this one. Right? Holiday time. Fun pen. So that's cute. Little pineapple. Let's see. I got a couple of these. Of the gold stars. So one must have been given to me. I got this one here. The daisy. I thought that was cute. I think this came from Dollar General, if I'm not mistaken. Jingle Bells. I love this one. I love that noise. Oh, I love that noise. Let's see. Oh. Rosemary, you rock up. I had this in my pen collection, Rosemary. She made me a mini pocket letter. And I still have it. I wonder why I had it in with my pens. I don't know why. But now that's got to go in a folder. I'm putting that over there. Okay. Look. Hamburger. Squishy. Right? Got this. The narwhal. Flamingo. Flower. Here's one. This is cute. Right? I like that. This is the one I just got. Right here. These are the light up ones that you got from the Dollar Tree last year. I got the diamond one. Ice cream. Pizza. And that's a squishy. Guys, we are not even in this. Lipstick. <laughs> That's a pen. There you go. That's a pen. Look how pretty. Right? That came from Walmart, I believe. That was given to me. Pearl. Look at. Look, guys. <laughs> all that I showed you so far. All the pinwheel. Yep, we all had the pinwheel one, right? From the Dollar Tree. Then another one with the stone at the top. Another Jingle Bell. I like those. I love those. I like the ones that make sound. Oh, this one here. That one. Look at that. Flamingo. Then my one-eyed unicorn. <laughs> Okay, what else? Oh, a little banana. <laughs> this came in friend mail. This little flower. And this is a pineapple. All pens. Then my little light up pen. Little. That's a little bunny rabbit. What's this? This is a flower. Another pinwheel. Donut. Let me try and get through this. Another pineapple. This fun pen. That was friend mail. I believe. This is friend mail. I like these. These are cute. They're different. This is the hourglass. Let's see. That one, this one should light up. Yep, look at that. This is a little chickadee. This was friend mail. Rose, how pretty is that? Very pretty. Sparkly rose, I got this one. All sparkle. Got this one. Looks like a taco. 
with the sour cream on top. All right, let me go through them faster. Got this one with the eyeballs. They pop out when you squeeze it. Another narwhal. This was friend mail. That one. Remember these that I bought from the Dollar Tree? Another red light up. And these from last year, so they still light up. I got another lipstick. Oh, I got a toilet. That's friend mail. I thought it was adorable. There's the pen on the bottom. How cute, right? Press the button, lift the lid. <laughs> I love that. That's one of my unique ones. Donut. All right, let me just, wait. Oh my gosh, guys, oh my gosh. That was more friend mail. I got a bunch of the flowers. Another panda. The, I don't know, that one. That one, mermaids, I guess. Unicorn. The feather pens. Feather. Another one of those. Oh, this was friend mail. My son liked these. Oh, here's another flamingo. This was friend mail, the keys. And these are pens, guys, right there. My son liked these. I told him, you want one, you can have it. Take it, put it in your office. Here's the other key. Very unique, right, guys? And this is that spyglass one that we got from the Dollar Tree that just came out. Another one of those. Then I got this squishy one. Where it's like... <laughs> We're getting there. Another unicorn, a star. Mermaid tail. Flamingo. And we're coming to the end. I got these. They do all different colors. This one has that stuff on it. This one's plain. Got the sloth donut. There's another one of those. This is green eggs and ham, Dr. Seuss. This one here, it's got the thing in it where the little beads, like the maze, this goes on the bottom of that flamingo, that big one. And then I got some tops here at the bottom. And then this little mini pen. So that's it. Oh, let me show you this. <laughs> I got them working. Watch. Told you guys, just bang them around a little bit. The batteries will loosen it. Remember I had trouble with these two? And I said you had to leave the things in the bottom. The things are no longer in the bottom. And they work. So it was just the batteries were a little loose. So that had to get tightened up. So I wanted to show you that. That worked. Okay. So that's everything that I've been working on. Love how my pillow came out. Love it. Guys, simple, super easy. What it costs. $2 and change for the pillow for the stuffing, but I got tons more stuffing. $2 for this, a dollar for this, uh, I call it like a twine, but it's more cloth-like. And uh, to do the whip stitching around. Yeah, so there you go. I like the way it came out. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. You finally saw my pen collection. Thing is huge, yeah. Got so many, now it's a big pile here, and now I have to sort it all out. Okay, I'll show you this after it gets the hood on it and the pockets. And this I gotta put away in, um, cause I think I have another one too, that I have like in a folder. And this came from Rosemary You Rock Art. So if you don't watch her channel, go check her out. She does all these kind of crafty things. She does Dollar Tree hauls. she does cook shows she shows you how to cook better than me so anyway go check rosemary's you rock art okay 
That's it. I hope you like my tree too. I hope you'll like that, my little winter tree. But like I said, I'm gonna take the little things off there. Okay, now that's it. Stay safe out there. Until next time, guys. Bye now.